Okay, it's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Eingen. It's a bottle of this celebrated Doppelbock. Beer coming in at 6.7% ABV. There's a little look at the label. White bottle cap. Let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. This beer was kindly sent to us by our channel sponsor, beersofeurope.co.uk, the largest online beer store in the UK, where you can get fabulous German style Doppelbox, Belgian doubles, Belgian triples, amazing German beer, American craft beer, some of the best UK beer that's on offer at the moment. If you want a decent beer, check out beersofeurope.co.uk. Okay, so on with the beer. Nice levels of carbonation. Can you see that carbonation rolling up the side of the glass there? Look at that. It's a one to two finger tan coloured head. A nice dark clear very kind of mahogany looking ale. Let's get the aroma. Oh and this ascends me to heaven. Burnt toast, malty bread, a nice level of sweetness, a little bit of raisin. It smells fantastic, gotta dive into this one. Cheers everybody. Oh. Wow, that is absolutely fantastic. Eyinger, well, they produce fantastic German beers. Uh, when I was on the Beers of Europe website, I had a look and I found the kind of the beer. And as soon as I seen Eyinger, they produce a Doppelbach, bang, that went in my basket for the beers we review for Beers of Europe and it hasn't disappointed at all. It's everything and more that I expected from this German style Doppelbock. The beer's got a kind of a rushing carbonation in your mouth and that helps to push the beer around and, and explode that flavour on the tongue. And that flavour being like a, like a slight raisiny, fruity, Slightly vinous kind of quality to the beer, and then you've got the the the, the really nice toasty, malty, biscuity, that brown, freshly baked brown bread flavour in the beer. It's, it's wonderful, really wonderful. It's got a lovely mouthfeel also. It's kind of medium, a medium body mouthfeel. It's like kind of chocolatey mouthfeel to it. It's nice and sweet. There's a nice sweetness to the beer. And a nice, not overly done, but balanced bitterness. And it's slightly, the bitterness is, is a very traditional bitterness. It, it's not a, a raging kind of 60 IBU bitterness. I mean, if you're, if you're old school into your beer, you know your beer, this is an obvious thing to you guys that a Doppelbock isn't massively bitter, but uh, the way we're going with the brewing industry at the moment, I've, I've got to kind of mention this because a lot of beers are becoming very bitter. And then if you're new to beer, then, then you might think that most beers are bitter, but there are some really nice kind of sweet, malty styles of beer that blow me away just as much as the bitter beers do. but fantastic quality. As I said, biscuity, bready, malty brown bread. It's a fantastic brew. It's like kind of vinous quality going on, a little bit of raisin. It's fantastic. One thing, one thing that I want to show you, again from a German beer, you've got that kind of line there on the bottle. That's where it German beers, you get a little bit of money back for each bottle, and that's where it's got cleaned and re-kind of filled with beer on its side. 
So I, I think that, and that's been done over and over again, as you can see by the that line that just stays on the bottle. But thank you to Beers of Europe for sending. Let's give this beer a rating. I think it's a wonderful beer. For that 6.7% ABV, you do not get, well, I suppose you get a tiny kick of alcohol, but it's nothing too dramatic. Uh, the beer is nicely blended, and it, it, uh, with the flavours, I mean that the alcohol's blended in with that flavour, so it's a fantastic beer. Uh, for all them reasons, for the reasons I gave earlier, I'm going to give this beer a massive 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Real Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews, and cheers.